Uncle Ray at the farm has so many potatoes, too many in fact. Mm. What did Uncle Ray do? Sent these fine chips to us in Ireland. Because he knows we'll eat all of them. Yeah, I mean, I'll eat anything, literally anything. <laughs> Put them in my mouth, Ray. You ask us what flavors there's gonna be, and we really, we really dig deep, and it's salt and vinegar. It's like sour, sour cream and cheese. Cheese? Yeah, Pepper. is that a general? I suppose it is a general yeah. flavor. I love a sour cream and onion, and yeah. I love Ooh. like a meat flavored crisp. Yeah. I think it's gonna be um, Uncle Ray's barn, <laughs> um, pig sty, haystack, uh, haystack, and Ray stack. Chipotle and Jack cheese naturally and artificially flavored. So you could just say flavored. Just say flavored and yeah. incorporates everything. These are very good value. One dollar thirty nine for a bag. That's not bad. You wouldn't get that here now. You, no, you would not. And sure, there's the man himself. Ray. What age is he there? Growing up poor had his blessings. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, I feel bad for saying he looked weird. I'm sorry, Uncle Ray. <laughs> In Ireland, if someone said to you, "I'm going to tell you a story about the life and times of Uncle Ray," you'd be like, "Okay, what? What was the crime?" Chipotle. Are you a fan of Chipotle? I never know. We're about to find out. Oh, that's good. <laughs> they smell amazing. I'm very excited right, about this. Okay, I just took loads out. That's okay. Good big chip. And the ripple. Do you know how much I like the ripple crisps? Each chip is in the shape of a different state. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yes, Louisiana. Oh my. <laughs> oh my God. Oh. These are stunning. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh, Ray. You cray. I'm tasting flavors both artificial and natural. <laughs> Sweet Jesus. Oh fucking hell. Mm, Uncle Ray, you were you got it going on. This is not a chip flavor that I think I've had before. No. You know what? These taste really good. Yeah. The ridges and everything, it's just more flavor. And they're just the right amount of crispiness. Mother of God. I would describe it as a very strong cheese taste with like a little hint of a kick. They're not the best crisps I've ever had, but not the definitely not the worst. They're they're um they're very munchy. You keep eating them. You keep mm. coming back from a work. Mm. But the flavor is incredible, and they're not too spicy at all. And they're kind of melty in oh. a weird way. How do you say it? Chipotle. 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 Not chipotle. I don't believe so. Chipotle. 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 But this is like this next is level. Something completely new. And yeah. I, I love it. I absolutely love it. Good man, Ray. He knew what he was doing. He, he wanted to create something of its own. He didn't want to. He want to copy the trends. He, exactly. No he cheese wanna... and onion for Ray. No, no sirree. No sirree. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Give us the bag. Whoa! Sour cream and onion. I'm so excited. Woo! This is what I want. Ooh, they're not ridged. Bag's been opened. Lot eaten from it. So obviously very popular. This is a man who wants to stand out from the crowd, but also wants to take a well-established flavor and make it his own. And I appreciate that in a man. It is genuinely though a good-looking bag. It is a good. It's a great-looking bag. Each bag is a different blurb in the bag. This one's got chapter 13. Last night, chapter five. He's written like his life's memoirs in the what? back of these crisps. Chapter 13. Riding out the storm. <laughs> He's now in the Navy. Oh, and then at the end, patience, making the best of a tough situation, keep trying until you succeed, changing the things you can and accepting those you can't. I mean, he's like a little fortune cookie. What's that flavor at? Come on, oh, oh, Wes. <laughs> oh, you have to get in on these, they're so yeah, good. I, can I just? Yeah, I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is, sour cream and onion flavored. Oh my God, yeah. They're bursting with flavor. I know. They're so thin, they nearly slice through your tongue. It's a good chip. You bring it down to the field, you watch the innings, you watch the pitches, mm. all of the stuff that goes on in a baseball game. They break so easily. They're covered in oil. Mm. And they're really, really good. The only thing is that they're so thin. Mm. Like they literally, I feel like one's like lodged in my tooth. Not as good as the previous chip, which is, ooh. Yeah. I'm gonna have more of that when this is all done. This is one of my favorite flavors of crisps, so yeah. I'm, just, I'm just very happy. These are what crisps will taste like in heaven. Yeah, totally. I think, I think, I think there's a kind of quintessential sour cream and onion flavor that goes on. And it's not bad. It's doing what it's doing. Like 10 out of 10 for those. Yeah. Well, sorry. May not 10. But yeah, not 10. Come on, Uncle Ray. I mean. <laughs> Come on, Ray. Like, I'm holding out for the good stuff, Ray. Maple bacon. Oh, oh my god. Bacon god. is good for me. Oh my god. Oh my oh god. Best food ever. Okay. All right. That's a bit different, isn't it? Yeah. Alright. Okay, so his lesson of this packet is self-control. Rejecting wrong desires and doing what is right. Not as much with you there. Ooh, that's a strong smell of maple. Oh, sweet lord. It's bacon flavored, but I don't believe there's any bacon in it. Yeah. Oh, I, here we go. Just, just peachy. peachy. And self-control. You know what I don't get? 
He talks about self-control and then he gives us these. Oh my God, it's so <laughs> true. It's just like the, the, the gospel according to Ray. And then Ray said upon to the people, take these crisps and have them and share them among you. Who and doesn't yes. like maple and bacon? Perfect combination, come on. Strong, strong maple smell out of the bag. Yeah, I, I could actually get it from over here. Look at this gigantic crisp that's It's survived. got the ridges, oh it's God. got the ridges. How did this survive? Yeah. It's mm. amazing but it's, it's my least favorite of all of them so far. But still good. There's like an immediate maple taste. Yeah. Oh, they're good. They're, they're easy. This is interesting. You know, he knocked it out of the park with the first one. This, I've never heard of before, and this is lovely. It's all maple. Mm. It's good. It's not really strong to bacon. It's more maple. Yeah. It's all maple. There's a kind of aftertaste, which I guess is meant to be bacon. I'm not really getting it. Not really getting it. And there's no cholesterol in it, so that's even better. No cholesterol. Look, it says cholesterol, OMG, 0%. That's bizarre. <laughs> For me, not as enjoyable as the other two. The other mm -hmm. two, I was just fucking all up in my feelings. They were amazing. What's your view on the goo from the tree, known as maple? I quite like maple. I just imagine them in the factory now, just like, um, hey, Mr. Ray, I'm just not so sure that these maple bacon ones are gonna appeal to the mass market. Put the crisps in the bag. Well, I do like maple syrup, you know? Mm, me too, but I think it's just too strong in this. I, he has the capability to make such an incredible crisp that I feel like, this deserves better. Maybe he should have had some self-control with this packet. Maybe, maybe. Give it to me. Oh, hot flavored. Okay. So oh wow, they didn't even didn't give any fancy names. It's just hot flavored. Watch out. Yes. Do you love a spicy? Crisp? I I love really? a spicy crisp. I, like when I eat something hot, I want it like just to burn the entire of my mouth. Wow. Yeah. I mean, I'd, I'd much prefer a cold flavor. Oh, a nice little chili chip. A note of the day is respect. Respect. Okay. Well, Following fair. the rules, treating your superiors and coworkers with respect, letting bygones be bygones. Oh wow. Well, that's you know all quality life lessons from Uncle Ray. I don't like the bag. The bag's very threatening to me. Yeah. Bag's really making me scared. Okay, I expected a little bit more on the hot, hotness scale. Ooh, well they look like they are freaking coated. Oh, they're very orange. They're very red and very orange. They're very hot. I can like a hot thing. Yeah. I don't do it as a personality trait. I'm not like at dinner demanding extra jalapenos in my meal. Just a bit like paprika or something. No, they're not as hot as I thought No, it'd be. the hundred year old uh, Doritos, you know. Oh, it's got a, it's got a, it's got a kick. There's definitely a mm -hmm. slow burn. It's it the, builds up, does it? It builds up. They're spicier now. You're gonna feel that by having that many. Ray isn't fucking around. She said, "I don't like. I don't, <coughs> I don't like those." Uh. Oh no! <clears throat> if you took a big handful of them, shoved them into your gob, I think you'd be regretting it. I've got a very strong tolerance for spice. Really? Mm. I just like I take the heat and I just extrude it through my face. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I do with it. Oh no, Ray! Ray has done you a disservice. Jesus! Well, like I don't know what I expected. It literally says hot with flames on the bag. Is there a particular flavor? Uh, <clears throat> cayenne. Yeah, cayenne, paprika. Paprika? Those two things. If you don't like hot, like spicy crisps, you're probably not gonna enjoy Ooh, these. I can feel it now. Yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah, just, yeah. it just like, it's there in the back of my mouth, like playing, like punching with my tonsils. Oh no, I don't, I don't like that. That's, that's a tough one now. <laughs> in the beginning, didn't get a spice. They're very spicy. Yeah, actually it builds up quite well. Yeah. And the more it builds up, the more I like them. I don't want any more of these. Okay. Well, it's not stopping, is it? I want the first ones again. I want to meet this man. Yes. I want to shake his hand and say thank you. Your potatoes have inspired me. Gosh by gosh, I really enjoyed the first one. Like it really, it really set a standard that I thought the rest would attempt to go near. Mm. But the other, the others were just doing their own thing. Keep doing what you're doing. You make yeah. some incredible crisps. And judging by the fact that there's at least 19 chapters on the back of them, <laughs> uh, what are the other flavors? Or maybe does he just put them out at random on the? Th you know, I just. I have a lot of questions. Um, do you like eating crisps? Do you like watching people eating stuff? Fear not, because there's loads more videos about crisps on the Tri channel. Not always about Uncle Ray, but it's fine, you can't win them all. How about you hit the bell, subscribe, like the video, and stay tuned for more, because um, crisps are great, and so is Ray. And so is the Tri channel, so stick around.